Hello you guys, what is up and welcome back to my channel. I appreciate you so much for being here today. In this video, we are going to be budgeting out my second paycheck cash stuffing of June. And I'm gonna be walking you guys through how I kind of do that process. And I'm just gonna break it down for you guys. So if y'all are new, um, I am a stay-at-home mom, but I do bring in an income from my Etsy shop and my YouTube channel. And today we are going to be budgeting some money from uh, my Etsy shop. I do launches a couple times a month. And yeah, that's what we're going to be stuffing. So we are actually going to be budgeting uh, $500. So what I like to do, also, I kind of just jumped right into this, but... I do the cash envelope method if you guys are unfamiliar. I basically stuff all of these categories with money. This is my bill binder, this is my sinking funds binder, and I kind of just go through them and tell my money where to go. So that's basically what we are going to be doing in this video. Um, I'm going to show you guys kind of my thought process and how I do my budget. Um, just because it's so interesting to see what other people do with their money. Um, I just love to see it. It's just so interesting. So I hope these colors will show up on camera. But what I'm going to do first is first we're going to write down what we're doing. Okay, so what I do is just write what type of money it is, uh, like my main paycheck, a side hustle for me, a YouTube check, whatever it may be. I write what it is, the date, and how much we're stuffing. And then what I'm going to do is go, go through my binders and write down all my categories that I will be stuffing. So we're just going to go ahead and do that. categories listed out I'm gonna go ahead and start telling the money where to go so what I'm gonna do is grab my calculator and then I first tackle my bills so what I'm gonna do is start with 500 because that is our starting amount and then I'm just gonna go down the line until I'm out of money basically so I start with my bills and like I mentioned this is the second cash stuffing of June so I already have some of my bills um, started so I have $60 here in utilities and I'm gonna go ahead and add 50 so then we're gonna minus 50 so 450 and then I just keep going um, this is my internet bill and it is $70 every month and I have 30. I'm going to go ahead and add 25. I still have a couple more stuffings left for June, but I want to go, go ahead and take care of most of my bills. So, all right. So that's good for their electric. My electricity bill was higher last month. It was like 150. So I'm going to go ahead and put 60. And that'll put us at 110. So yeah, that'll be good. Because my it's summer, so my electric bill did go up. And then I'm also gonna put 60 into car insurance, you guys. I know that's a lot, but that would put us at 400. And honestly, I kind of want to just get this over with and like pay paid for. So I'm gonna focus on that. So I'm gonna put 60 and then Stella, I am gonna put 20 to put her at 200, but I did get her groomed. So I have 180 left in here. So I'll put her at 200 and then my lawn care, I'm just gonna add 10. 
and I will be paying this at in two weeks. Um, that will be $60. So put 10 in there for now. And then my phone bill, I'm going to put 15. And that'll put me almost paid up on that one. It's, this is $50 every month. And then my hospital bill, we're going to put our usual 50 because that is kind of a lot. I do 50, 50, and then 60 because this is um, 160 a month. Yeah. Okay. And then how much? I'm almost done with this first page. Okay. And then for my baby's birthday, since I did make each one of these $10, I'm going to do a 10. This is from the craft bin. Dawn, she custom made this for me. This is my baby's name. How freaking nice was that? So I made each little block $10. And this is just saving up for his birthday next year. So I'm going to add 10. Hopefully I already subtracted it from there. I cannot remember if I did. And then we're going to put five in renter's insurance. How is that 204? Okay, I must have messed up somewhere. I'm going to go ahead and redo this. So 500. Okay, so I have 195. I honestly don't even know if that's right. All right, let's see. We're gonna move to my sinking funds and we're gonna start with my savings and I'm actually gonna put 20. Yeah. Okay, so let's do 20 and 175. Okay, so there's that. And if you guys missed my, one of my, uh, which video was it? One of my latest videos. I gave some updates on my amounts in here. I have about $1,800 in my savings account in the high yield account. And then I'm just starting over um, in here, as well as my emergency fund. Every time I hit $100, I'm gonna deposit it. So I have 20 of that 100, so that now I'll have 40. I hope that makes sense. And then emergency, I have $40 in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and add 20 as well, which will put us at 60 in here, but I have 1400 in the bank. And then self-care is actually at zero. I emptied this out. So I'm gonna put 20 in here. And I just bought some new foundation and um, mascara and some other stuff at Ulta. Um, and then fun is also actually empty as well. I don't even know what I spent this on. Okay. Crawfish fund, which is actually kind of like my eating out envelope is going to get $10. And I did take some money out of here because I went out to dinner with one of my friends. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 50, 60. So yeah, there's $80 in here, which is still really good. So yeah, we went to Chick-fil-A, so I just took out $20, but I am going to put 10 back into here. And I don't know if I already subtracted it. Okay, I need to focus. All right, my baby, I'm gonna put 20. And then my future house, I'm going to put 10. Okay, car maintenance. I'm putting 20. I'm going to try to put 20 every time at the minimum. Um, possibly more, who knows. But for now, I'm just going to try to put 20 every time. I did take out 20 because I got my car washed. So I'm basically just replenishing that. But my car was super dirty because we took it on the road trip and there was snacks spilled all in there. So it desperately needed a wash. So I did take out $20 and then I'm just going to put the usual five in my future car down payment. And I'm also just, I think, going to do five in medical. Let's see, holidays, I am going to round that. So I'm going to do fifth. Fifteen. 
yeah 15. father's day is literally next weekend well i guess this weekend um that's crazy okay and then christmas i'm doing usual 20. and i think i did forget to subtract that one earlier because i was gonna do 20. okay wait let me quickly redo this Okay, so that leaves me with 20. I thought I felt like 30 was high, but 20, I'm gonna put 20 in retirement. We're saving for retirement. Okay, so that's that's it. Um, that's kind of how I work through my budget. So now obviously, as you guys saw in the calculator, I was left with zero dollars. And all of my categories have been accounted for. All of my bills are paid. And then from whatever's left after I take care of my bills, I just put towards all my sinking funds um, until I have no money left. So that is kind of my process. And um, yeah, as you, and obviously this is not any of my variable spending with my gas, groceries, eating out, spending, any of that stuff. Um, I have like a different process for that, as you guys know, um, but this is, system has literally changed my entire view on money. So if you guys are struggling, um, please give this system a try. Even if it's not this many categories, even if you just start with a couple, you guys will see a huge just change whenever you practice consistency with it. So please give it a try if you have been on the fence um it's literally amazing so that is going to conclude my budget with me portion of this um paycheck stay tuned for the cash stuffing which will be coming probably my next video um so i love you all so very much thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you have not already on your way out it is totally free and i'm almost at 10 thousand subscribers you guys i love you all so much and i will see you very soon with another video bye guys